Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. The lads have been getting on with the garden wall quite well. Oi, oi. They're getting round there, but Tricky Bricky is not on the garden wall today. I'm off to another job. I've come to pick up the hog carrier from here and we're going to go over to another job and do some brickwork. Right, so I'm over here at the next job. This job's a new job for you guys. You haven't seen this one before. I have been over here as well. We had to get some things sorted out over here. It was a bit higgledy piggledy. There's a bit, of, a bit of an issue with some levels over here, but we've managed to get over it. We've got it all up to where it should be. So now it's time to crack on and get some blocks down. Let's do it. Right then, ladies and gentlemen, here we are on the job. It's a big house that's had some knocked down. Has some original bits of the house. There's some original bits of the house. We've done all sorts of bits and bobs around the back here to get it all leveled up. A new extension and stuff. But we've got it all to a level now, which we're happy with. Which is good. So we've got plenty of pull in, but it's very, very windy over here big open field behind me so it's a bit difficult to go too high so it's going to be a bit of a couple of courses on the outside a couple on the inside keep backing it up as I go long plank now easily easily blow over so we've got to be careful you get on the outside first of all get some of the heavy concretes on two courses on the outside first and then we'll back it up on the inside lovely old job well, I've quickly just taken a couple of courses off of here because some of this was leaning out so I've taken this off I'm going to get it back back in, it was leaning out about 10 mil. I can just see it, I don't want it wrong so I'm going to replay them once and then we can go on top of this here we go, nice and upright through there again now happy days happy with that now so I've gone two courses I'm two courses above, so it's a windy day, so I'm going to go two wheels back down the far end now. I'm going to two together, then I'll run these two in, get the insulation in, then back it up. So I'm going to get down that far end now, get this course. A couple of courses ranked up. got my rack done now that's all there I've got my line set up on that so I'm gonna run through now run through this wall run these two courses in then I can get in there and get this insulation behind it oh yes
first two courses on the way through there now. Woo! Blow your whole day! Haha, <laughs> now it's time to get on the inside and back this up quick. I'll put my ND filter on my camera now so we can see. It's like a set of sunglasses. <laughs> so I've got my insulation in now through there. Lovely. So let's get these next two courses on. Then we can tackle this corner here. I'm gonna get all this rack sorted out and get this round the corner so then we can pull from that corner over there through this flank as well. Lovely. Right, so when I'm laying my blocks, there's all sorts of ways that you can do it. So one way to perp your block is to put it on your knee like that and do your perp on it. And then as you bring it in, I like to pop the block on the wall, then pick up my trowel. Left hand controls this side, right side with this. So I'm whacking down there, I'm keeping it rigid with my left hand, pushed in. Now we know we're nice and good. Just get that curve behind there. We know we're nice. Another way you can perk your block, get me muck like this, double lift the rough end of the block on there. Let's pull the line back a little bit. Because the rough end's on the block, the muck will stick to it. If it's a smooth end of the block, like this end, it's a bit dusty, sometimes it'll fall off. There we go. Straight on, again left hand there, tap down to the right. That's good. Bosh, perfect block. Another one. Bosh, bosh. Always leave the rough end ready to lay against. And 
and it is as easy as that. Gosh, lovely. That's what you can't see. That's that bad boy up. Goody gum drops. Right, now we're over here, gonna get this corner done. Lovely. Joyce Tangers coming all the way through this bit here. And I've also got to make up, I've got a bit of a cut to go in here to get it back to Bond. There's three Joyce Tangers that have been missed here. So I think the only way they're gonna get in there now is if we take these noggins out gonna get him in otherwise so I'll we'll speak to the chippy now and get him to knock noggins out so we can get our joist hangers in. Yo right I've got to get that is 215 off of that floor so we've got bits and bobs here I think I need to make about a 30 mil piece to go on top of these and then a full block and it'll bring it back to the gauge there so that's what I'm gonna do I need to get a piece to the height of that timber there. If I get a piece on that timber there, which is 40 mil to there, 30 mil piece through there, then I'm back to full blocks for this corner. And these are all in at the right heights then. Lovely, so that's what I'm gonna do. There we go then, we've got a load of them cut. Bosh, good, so I can get this corner right round now. Get this nice. Gives us another big flank to pull through then once this runs up. And that's the last of the corners other than the one over here, which is our only access at the moment. So I'm gonna leave that down until the rest of this is all at full height. Then we can just stitch that little bit in at the end. Lovely. Give this a quick join up, get the tools packed up, it's time to head on home, oh yeah. So on a windy day like today, that's a lovely old job. Let's get out of here. Please don't forget to hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe, and hit the notification button so you're informed whenever we upload a video. And don't forget, tonight, the Tricky Bricky Experience, half seven till whenever. Tune in, oi oi. So ladies and gentlemen, Dale the hog carrier has just dropped one in the car. Oh my God, the window's open. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I'll catch you in the next one. But until then, have a great evening. Peace out and... Wow! <laughs> <laughs> See you later, guys.